Have you ever, uh, have you already, yeah. have you ever went over whatever from the field and scored all your points in three ball? No. Did you didn't realize didn't. that you didn't hit a shot today? Uh, I felt it, but I was more so thinking, like, yeah, well, what, what can I do since I'm not making shots to help the team? That's all I was going to do. What gives you that confidence to keep on driving in there, going into the thick of it when you can't get a shot to go? Uh, just my basketball knowledge and me being a player, just uh, understanding that at some point one shot could get you going, whether it's a free throw or a layup or a free throw. So I was just thinking, like, yeah, if I'm wide, wide open, take it. But if somebody else is hit them, and just, I was just thinking more so of defense and getting stops. What was it like seeing Urosh grab that rebound after that, that three rolled out? And then what did you kind of see to, to get that steal on the inbound play? Oh, I was, I was hyped up. He got me hyped up after he started flexing and stuff. I was like, I was like, ah, oh, yeah, we got this one. We got this one. And seeing the time wind down and knowing that we had all these players in trouble, I just knew that I had to bring everybody together. And not only me, everybody had to bring each other together even closer and just lock in. It's been a shaky last few weeks for y'all. They went on an 8-0 run right before that. Closing strong, how important is that for your conf y'all's confidence as a team? Uh, we know no matter what the situation is during the game, that we all got to have each other's back. Uh, even if you're getting yelled at, somebody's going to come up to you and say, yo, we got you, so just lock in. What's it like having a teammate like Rose? I mean, it seems like if someone gets in someone's face, he's the first guy there to, to back him up, and he's always there. Uh, it's amazing because, like, even off the court, me and him, we go at it sometimes, him, maybe I'm another player. Uh, but it's great because no matter what, how much we argue, we know he got our back and we got his back. And he's the biggest guy out here. So <laughs> nobody's really going to try to mess with him. Who wins the battles between you and me? 100% me. New York? Yeah. He always seems ready to fight. Is he just always ready to fight? Oh, uh, no, he just has that, like, that burst to him. So he's like, like we, we all look at each other like brothers. So he's like, you know, I got your back no matter what. But if, like, we arguing and stuff, he gonna go at us. But if you see somebody else, it's like the end of the world. You, know, you can't do that. He leads the team out of the tunnel for away games. I'm assuming that's intentional. Yeah, him and Santi usually lead the way. Even even at home games, <laughs> they lead the way, and um, we follow them. We we get really hyped in the back. We see a bunch of crazy stuff. We start dancing. But he he gets us really hyped and brings a lot of energy. What's he doing well in the court right now? What's the strengths with his game? Oh, uh, really? He's just bringing that energy. He's giving us an extra boost. Uh, whether Johnny, Johnny's down or he comes out the game, maybe foul trouble. Uh, he just comes in the game and gives us that burst. Whether it's a, a big rebound, a hook shot, but really just and he bought into his role with Big Con uh, in the last few weeks. So just that really changed the dynamic of our team just with him. You held Scotty Pippen to those three made baskets. What led to that success? Uh, really just seeing that he was the leading scorer. And I I proud myself a lot of defense, and I know my team does the same thing. So I was just knowing that he ain't about to get off on me. <laughs> I ain't, that's not going to happen. He's he going to earn every bogey. So even even in the midst of the game, he's just, like after the game, he's like, yeah, he gave me a run. Just, just two more. Okay. Y'all good? Pretty good? Yeah. Awesome.